Hey guys, welcome back. I am Golden Knight, and I'm bringing you another episode of Amnesia, a Machine for Pigs. So we just got into the church, and he felt like he would be safe here, but we're going to find out soon that he will not. Got an open door. I don't like open... Oh my god, all these doors are open. I hate open doors. Hmm, all these cabins are locked, so I don't... Well, that was loud. I don't think I can hide on anything. The type of pick comes after me. Chuck this at it. Oh, da, da. All right. I do see that note. I'm just going to check the drawers first. Uh, biblio. B -b Biblia. Ah. November 23rd, 1899. Twin candles bent to the will of the central saint, casting their light to the corners of the chapel. Father Jeremiah, I thought, could be trusted with the secret, but he is like all the others. So the old priest has gone to the holding pens with his flock. He says he will enter into our world with them. A shepherd in his Hmm. A flock. Alright. Get out of my way. I don't know what those noises are. But I don't like them. Let's try this door first. Okay, we're going to go up this one. See, I think it both leads to the same spot, so it doesn't really matter. God, there's a lot of rooms up here. A gramophone. Your faith shackles your vision, Professor. It is an iron coffin that keeps you from grasping the future. We require a new deity. One of steam and the wheel of magnetism and progress. The old god is nothing more than a lamed hog. Spitting back awful at mankind. Uh, I keep on alluding to these piggies. Um, we got one door here. So we'll do one door. One door. I... Oh, my epic entrance! Oh! All right, we're gonna walk right to it. Oh, they're pigs. Why not? Where's that coming from? Aha! I found a secret. A cryptic clue, some kind of mechanism, a secret and inferno one no doubt. The missing candlestick is clearly the answer. But why? This I cannot fathom. Why hide secret messenger in a place of prayer? And where are the faithful? Why are the drag marts about the altar as if someone was pulled away? That's not good. Alright, we're looking for a candlestick. Oh, I can light these. Whee! Let's make it look pretty. Alright, so we need to find a candlestick for this one, I'm guessing. I don't know if it'll be around here, but we'll find out in just a second. Got a lever. Okay, that doesn't do anything. Uh, can we open that? Okay, nothing. So that's probably what I'm... Well, that's not a secret. It's not much of a secret. I like those, but I can't like whatever. All right. Uh, candlestick. Can I like these? I can dance on them. Oh my god, that's a pig. Oh well, that's fucked up. What are we worshiping pigs? Is there one over here. What? I thought I heard something. Yep, that's another pig. Alright, so we're looking for a candlestick. I didn't go down that one way. So I'm going to go with the assumption that it's not going to be in the pews. 
Wait, I thought I saw a note here. Nah, that was a book. Teddy bear. Alright, so it's probably in one of these side rooms. Yeah, yeah, no. All right. Father Jeremiah's Journal, October 1st, 1899. They flock to us now, where once I had walked amongst them. I bring salvation, 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 salvation into their lives. Now drawn by warmth in winter, by the food that Mandis distributes. I think that's me. My church is full and my charges are saved. My, uh, he walks amongst them and they also worship, worship him. He will not allow them to work in his factories, claiming that his workforce are specially trained for new machinery he uses, and that it would be irresponsible, nay, unethical, to risk such precious lives as he sees here. A changed man since Mexico, it is to be praised that in the face of such appalling tragedy and from the confine, confines of his sickbed, as he is often changed to, chained to, he conducts one of the greatest and most benevolent charities in all of London. Not content with the rise to become the dominant food produce business in the land, he distributes his goodwill, his fares to the poor, and they congregate about his kingdom in gratitude. Okay, okay. Now, where's that thingy? And since I don't have an inventory, I mean. Oh, oh, oh! Hey! I don't like the sound changes. They make everything scarier. I'm also not a huge fan of the pigs everywhere. Whoop! Whoop! Ah. Oh, another note. Ah, uh, inferno machinery. The engine fires. The flames are stoked. I hear steam in the walls. Vib vibrations upon the very air. My heart falters at the prospect of throwing the lever and exposing the workings of this dark contraption. But my children beckon me on, and I cannot fail them. No, I cannot. So pull the lever. Whoop. It appears I have no choice, thus I descend and may God have mercy upon my soul. If this is my bedlam, and I am to be cast as Matthews, then I will wear that mantle for the sake of my boys, and face whatever horrors lie beneath the altar. Oh, fantastic. I think you're speaking out of turn, man. I don't know if I really want to find that. Uh, uh. Zombies. Do not start to upset the acquisitions. Okay. Listen, Papa. Hold the egg to your ear. You can okay, hear this the sea. Up. So, the people back. Oh God. My light's not working. Ah, no. Whew, these final thoughts. What exhumation is this? What rotten fruit? What be stitching of parts? I doubt I'll ever be found, yet I leave you this. Scrawled in the maladrious half-light whilst my tormentor shuffles below. My fellow prisoners keen and squeal in the gloom. And where I wait for the knocking upon my cage that signifies it is finally my turn to make that dark journey into the interior. Gah. It's back here. Can jump like maybe a foot. I got this. As long as nothing flies out at my face. Ah. I hear crying. That's not good either. Um. Oh. Okay. Got me. Oh. 
Oh, I gotta walk where the pig went. Thing still coming? It's like, but wait, is it patrolling? Oh, I think it's coming. I can hear it. Oh my god, it's like right there. It's literally right in front of me. Where's he going? You're going back? I don't know how I'm gonna get past that thing. There it is again. Okay, it's right at the end of the hall. So I have to somehow get past that thing. We're gonna have to make a sprint for it. Hold on. I gotta wait for him to pull, patrol back or I'm gonna get caught. That thing is ugly. Oh. Look at that thing. Super sleuth. There it is. So I'm gonna wait for it to go over there, to the right, and then I'm just gonna run my ass past it. So I think I'm faster than it. Okay, I'm past it, I'm past it. Oh, fuck me, okay. Oh. And so to the stoking, the fog will not lift, the ship is beclaimed, becalmed, everyone lies in the half-light waiting to drown in the dry air. He is the paperweight that ballasts them. Whew, thing's ugly. So I had my first run in. It's fantastic. I knew it was going to happen soon. All right. Load it up. Don't have much time left. Yeah. Oh, fucking pig, man. That pig looked like it was sewed together. We got some some taters. Mmm, taters. Oh, we found another secret. All right, so we're back outside. Uh, we got more 
Never mind, there's no gas in there. Yeah, these pig heads are everywhere. Oh, okay, finally, some calming music. Shut up, bird. Water in his shoes. Always the water, and the sparks of the embers of the wheels. It's too my bony! It's too damn bony! There's a snake in my boot. Mm, water. Oh. Water in my shoes. The Mandis Processing Company. My soul shudders at what I have seen. But at last, I have reached the main part of the factory. Now onwards, downwards, to find those flood waters and drain them away. Like Moses, I will cleave the waters and lift my little darlings clear of its vile cradle. So, so I'm confused. Like those people look like the people just go down there and they're held prisoner or something. Possibly. Just checking for notes, checking for notes. Oh, wait, we got this thing. Oh, so that's where we are. These so the map. men, Professor, these so-called men of vision, they would shackle the masses to a wheel and turn it till their backs break. All for that opiate, the lure of profit. These fools who lackey them, these priests, these officials, this government. They make pigs of us all. But what solution, my dear man? How to break a cycle? You cannot simply remove the promise of a better world for these unfortunates. In the workhouses, in the orphanages, the belief in heaven is surely the only sucker one can find. We do not need to wait. We can bring forth paradise now. We can speed the passion. With only a small sacrifice, we can hold the apocalypse. With just a small sacrifice, we can free our shackles and deliver them to paradise now. We can. All right. Downward. Downward and onward. That is dark. It's very dark. I don't like it when the light starts flickering. Hmm. That's why I don't like it when it flickers. Oh, oh, pig, pig, pig. Oh, he ran away. Where'd he come from? Where did he go? Where'd he come from? Cotton Eye Joe. Ugh. Okay, he must have been hiding behind the box. Like a douche. Um, where did you go, pig man? Ah, I'm gonna go this way. Shortcut. I don't want to go down there. Oh, I can go up too. Alright. Uh, we're gonna go... I, I lied. I'm gonna go down. Actually, actually, this would be a good place to stop at our crossroads here. So we can go down or up. I'm probably gonna go down. Maybe I'll change my mind later. But okay! We had our running. It is a pig. And that pig was fucked up. It's like stitched together with a human or something. I have no idea what the hell that is all about. Uh, but I guess we'll find out a little bit later. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And until next time, who's up?